So what is Surfer SEO used for? Welcome to my Surfer SEO Explained video where I'm going to quickly talk about what they have to offer and of course who they're beneficial for. If you would like to try them out, I will leave my link down below. They are a fantastic software and right off the bat, Surfer is going to be great for SEO. So if you have a website and you want to start ranking your articles much higher, they can walk you through the process and make your life a whole lot easier. They even have a new feature that allows you to not only get your content like pre-written, but analyze it and optimize it. So so that you can rank higher in the search engines. So first things first, there's going to be the keyword research aspect. This is where you can start off because if you're not sure what you need to write content about, this is going to be the step you need to do first. You can discover dozens of relevant topic clusters in a matter of minutes, establish topical authority, and prove your expertise with the keyword research tool. So if you wanted to put like the example in there, best SEO tool, what you can do is create your keyword research and go from there. I'm going to actually do a tutorial video that walks you through a lot of the processes, so I'm going to keep that pretty uh, simple there. After that, I think one of the best parts about this is going to be their content editor. This is kind of like gamifying SEO in my opinion. What it does is give you the SEO guidelines for your next awesome page. You can plan, research, create, and optimize easily without opening multiple tabs. So what's going to happen is let's say you want to actually do a article called best SEO tool. What it'll do is give you the guidelines about how many words you need to write, what specific keywords you need to be in there, maybe how many images and so on and so forth. Even better, they just came out with a new feature where you can actually have them write it with AI and do the whole thing for you with pretty much just about one click. Uh, I'm really looking forward to that. This is actually brand new. I purchased two credits for that, as you can see down below. So I will be doing those in the future. I'm really looking forward to testing it out. I've used all their other features, but I haven't used that because it's pretty much brand new at the time of creating that. Aside from that, there is going to be the ability for audits, depending on which plan you have for this. But this really goes in and it allows you to score your quick wins and find missed SEO opportunities. With Audit, you can quickly optimize your existing pages based on data from top performing search results. So once again, what are the articles in the top 10 doing? How can you match them? How can you improve upon them? That's what's going to allow you to move higher up in the search engines. Obviously, backlinks can help too, but, but this is a process that can be very helpful in terms of getting the upper hand or the edge when it comes to going against your competitors. Last but not least, there's going to be SERP analyzer queries, so you can find correlation between position and search results and on-page factors. For example, how many words is each article in the top 10 using? You know, you can find all the correlations between that. For example, let me just click on this one. This one was a while back, but allow me to load it up. Let's scroll down a little bit more. It talks about, so with 1 to 10, the word count is going to be around 2,700. And if you scroll down a little bit more, you can look at averages. You can go for keywords, for example. This is going to be the overall number you know, top 10 similar keywords, how many times you want to use them, the relevance, it's going to be much more important, meaning the ones on top, you're probably going to want to use even more. We dive even deeper when it comes to questions, popular words, popular phrases, common words. It pretty much does a lot of the brunt and <laughs> brute force work. If you had to go in there and actually collect all this data yourself, it would take just forever. So this is another great feature that comes along with Surfer. And keep in mind, they do have more aspects when it comes to them. Like they have the grow flow. That's going to be for the much bigger plan. I don't have that specifically, but if I click on it, it tells you about it. You can receive personalized recommendations designed to maximize your SEO efforts through bite-sized content, keywords, and internal link suggestions. So overall, this is a tool for SEOs. It is very valuable if it's in the right hands. There's a lot of great aspects to it. And I love the fact how they added AI to this as well. It's going to be brand new. So I'm really looking forward to testing that out. Either way, I hope this explains Surfer SEO and how it can help you out when it comes to utilizing this specific software. If you want to check it out, I will leave my link down below. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment in the comment box down below as well. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.